Yeah, I'll react to that, sure. My two favorite British people in the world. Well, not really, but I do like them. Hi, guys. Uh, Ricky Gervais and Gordon Ramsay, the F word. <laughs> Don't you dare. Demonetize. Preemptive like. Hi, guys. Uh, Channel 4 Entertainment. Let's go. Original link to the video, top of the description. You know it, right? Unless you're new. Hi, my name's Connor. Original link to the video, top of the description, right below that link to the Discord. Click on it, send it right over there. Click that big red button right now, please. Let's go. Yeah. I know you don't like fancy food. Enjoy the shepherd's pie. Absolutely wonderful. I, yes. I mean, shepherd's pie would be in, um, uh, I think, my top five. Really? Meals, so, oh, and, and that was same that here. Was lovely. The mince for the shepherd's pie was from the lambs that I had in my back garden. So, hold on. So, they were basically your pets. <laughs> they weren't pets. You right. can't fall into that habit of allowing okay. them to become pets, although they are very friendly to begin with, but then you've got to sort of distance yourself from them. Yeah, but you say that. Well, where's it going to end? You and Jeremy Clarkson in a helicopter <laughs> shooting your cousins. <laughs> what? You go, I kept distance from them. I didn't really know them growing up. <laughs> and they're so tasty. You're it's so the... macho, aren't you? I know, I know. It's a You're so handshake. tough. I'm glad you've got your shirt on. <laughs> you always have to show a bit of that, don't you? No, no, no. It's no. for the menopause of women. No. Go, oh, look, he's <laughs> taking his shirt off. He walked into the restaurant the other week no. carrying a stag. Who do you think you are? Four. <laughs> <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. No, but you enjoyed it, didn't you? I did enjoy it. Obviously, I'd rather know that that animal had a wonderful life Absolutely. and was killed humanely. Gavin um, escaped the OK, you've given it a name. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. I mean, wh why would you do that? What would... See, when you, when you buy it in Tesco's, there's not a name. <laughs> they don't care. This is Bob. We killed Bob. <laughs> Imagine on every package of meat in the grocery store, supermarket, it just says the animal's name. Oh, this was Gavin. Thank him. <laughs> okay. Gavin didn't die. Charlotte, unfortunately, got eaten. What, um, by a, a, well, we, we, a wolf? <laughs> a suspected puma, a wild cat, or you know, a humongous fox. Where, where do you live with these pumas <laughs> and humongous Puma. foxes? No, no it's it, it, Beckenham Palace Narnia. in the back garden. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, but this is serious. Who does the cooking at home? I do. <laughs> Not. I don't know. No. Ever? No. Let me tell you why, Gordon. Please. I'm a genius, <laughs> and I've, I've got to save all those skills for other things, OK? I thought Stephen Merchant was a genius. That can't. <laughs> for other th oh, Stephen Merchant. Things, OK? I thought Stephen Merchant was a genius. That can't. <laughs> uh, no, you're not just bloody brilliant at making people laugh. Uh, you're also bloody fantastic at making money. Um, the DVDs, the podcasts, the animals. Have you ever been tempted or swayed by doing an advert? No, I'm not tempted, yeah. no. I got offered a million pounds to do a gin advert in America, when the office broke in America. And my agent said, I know you don't do adverts, but I just run this by you. And I went, no, I can't. Because I just thought, if I said yes, I'd regret it. So I said no. And he said, they've come back with two million. They thought I was haggling. Oh, my God. Um, I think it's because you haven't had the right product, OK? So I've got some items that I want you to have a look at and tell me how you would market them in an advert. OK, first thing. Go on. Clock. Chocolate bar. It's a delicacy in Sweden. Um, how... Aren't foreigners funny? <laughs> so how would you advertise it? How would you sit there and munch? Why would you name a... If it's a Swedish advert, it would be a really weird one, wouldn't it? It would be something like... Mm. Oh, plup. Oh, it would be that, something like that, wouldn't it? That was perfect! <laughs> What's that one that, that that sexy rabbit used to advertise? Cadbury's caramel, no? Yeah. yeah. Yes. Tell us about that. Ready? Mm. <laughs> Sexy rabbit. Can we cut that? <laughs> I've never had sex with any rodent. Actually, it's a lagomorph. It's not a rodent. <laughs> OK, uh, this one, you like soups, don't you? Cap. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. OK, so it's a cock-flavoured bouillon. <laughs> cock flavour. Excellent. Oh, My favourite. God. Slurp it up. The great taste of cock. <laughs> Okay, okay, dude. Finally, to wash it all down. Oh, um, for <laughs> it's closer to Sweden. It's Denmark. Yeah, okay. okay. This would be ninja beer. <laughs> no, spunk. <laughs> I know what spunk means. I know what spunk means. I used to say I'm like full of spunk today, because like that means like you're spunky. You're you're ready to go. But uh, I guess that's a really gross sentence in 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 Britain. But I know what it is now. And I'm so happy that I know that I didn't even laugh. <laughs> no. Spunk. <laughs> Take a shot of spunk. A shot of spunk vodka. So. 
I'm slightly squeamish to drinks. But, oh. oh, I thought it was going to be like very gelatinous and, and clear whitish color. Oh, God. <laughs> the trouble, now, the trouble that that's very old spunk. <laughs> that's that spunk that's been hanging around for quite some time. Oh, How would you God. promote um, the Danish shot of spunk vodka? Mm. That's the best spunk I've ever tasted. <laughs> Do you know I learned on a QI episode that Danish spunk as you call it, is the number one export of Denmark. Like, semen is the number one export of Denmark. I, I could be wrong, but I think that's true. So, they export their spunk and spunk. Um, guys, I had a few things I wanted to say. They weren't pets. I love both of these men. Two of my top five favorite British. Um, my top five favorite Brits, my top two favorite Brits are, uh, are, uh, Boris Johnson and Jeremy, and Jeremy Corbyn. Um, then my next two favorite are Margaret Thatcher and I'm just trying to piss people off. All right. So, uh, no, um, two of my f favorite Brits right here. Uh, love it, but I had a question. Fall into that habit. You say that, well, where's it going to end? You... Although they are very friendly to begin with, but then you go, well, mints for the shepherd's pie. Oh, yeah, I love shepherd's pie, but I just re I realized after, after watching a video a while ago that I've never had shepherd's pie, apparently, because, and it completely makes sense, shepherd, shepherd's pie, shepherd, shep sheep, or they, they herd sheep, shep sheep. Um... So yeah, a, a shepherd's pie would be a pie, a shepherd's pie that uses sheep as the beef. Why did that take me so long? And I've never had a sheep. I've never eaten a sheep before. I've only eaten a cow. I've eaten a pig. I've eaten a chicken. I've eaten what other land-based animals? But anyways, I've always had shepherd pie with beef, with cow meat um but it's delicious but it's not a shepherd's pie i guess um but a uh, worcestershire sauce is delicious on mashed potatoes one one but on shepherd's pie it is mwah, so good i'm not saying like dump it all on before you serve it it's just like when you serve yourself a slice of shepherd's pie or you know a scoop you know dabbing on some worcestershire sauce every now and then it goes I love it. Um, I actually had something else I wanted to say. Charlotte, unfortunately, got eaten. Humongous fox. Wait, wait. <laughs> <laughs> and Stephen Merchant was a genius. So, bloody fantastic make that. No, I'm not tempted, yeah. no. My agent said, I know you don't do adverts. Yes, I do that. So I said, no. And he went for Spoken America. And my agent said, I know you don't. Here's where it was. Have you ever been tempted or swayed by doing an advert? No, I'm not tempting. Yeah. No. DVDs. Bloody brilliant at making people laugh. Uh, you're also bloody fantastic at making money. Um, oh, yes. This is this was it. Is bloody a swear word or not? Um, like, if you're a mother and you're like, eight, eight, like six-year-old kid said, Oh, I'm bloody starving, mother. Mother, I'm bloody starving. Like, would she be like, don't you say that? Or is it just not a swear? All right, love you guys. Uh, see you next time. That was my uh, seductive wink.